Aloha mai kako. Welcome to Halal na Pua Hala Kuno Ike Kai. It's me, Kumu Kanoi again, and I am the Kumu Hula of this Hula Halal, located physically in Nuuanu Valley on the island of Oahu, right here in Hawaii, but coming to you around the world via Facebook Live and YouTube. We're so glad to be with you. Today we're not actually live. This, of course, is a pre-recorded version of our show since we, like you, are celebrating New Year's Day. So we wanted to make sure to do a little recap of the year and share some hula since every week we've been sharing hula with you for, gosh, I don't know how many months, a lot of months now. <laughs> I hope you had a fabulous Kalikimaka Christmas or, you know, whatever holidays you may be celebrating with your ohana, your family. We had a great time and we're excited to get back with you in just a few short days, probably. Um, we have hula classes starting up again in 2022, our Tuesday night hula classes for adults, our Fridays for Keiki and then our Saturday Facebook lives even our Sunday one day workshops they'll all be back in 2022 but before we forge ahead we wanted to recap all the good things that happened this past year so without further ado I think it's time Aloha ho my welcome back. So every week when we are on our live classes, we do a little routine. We start with Hawaii Pono'i, we go through all of our oli and our pule, our chants and our prayers. And one of the chants that we've been focusing on towards the ending part of 2021 is actually a longer version of the oli aloha. So the oli aloha is known usually by just five lines that spell out A L O H A. And this is one of the first chants that I teach to my keiki when they come to our halal. But on our Facebook Live classes every week, we've been adding on one line, one line, one line. There's actually a much longer version of this chant written by Kumu Pilahi Paki. And I'd like to do this for you now. Usually we send this out to everyone who's watching live. And so to all of you around the world, I send my aloha. Oli aloha, pa. Akahai na Hawaii. Lo kahia kulike Olu olu kamana o Ha a ha ko kulana Aho nu yalana kila Aloha mai na hawaii ke aloha no kao me anui E o mai na hawaii na pua le na mamo Ala mai kala hui, lau lae kaulana, o mai kale hulehu, ha aheo o e hawaii, ano ai no ke aloha, ano ai no ke aloha, aloha. So during today's show, we wanted to take a look back at all that we've accomplished in this year, 2021, and kind of feature a few hulas, some of our haumana who have joined us. So this first hula that we're going to be sharing with you is called Kalei Mo'i. Lei, of course, is a garland, but this is not a garland of flowers. It is a garland of kings and queens. The word mo'i means royal one. And so this mele features each verse dedicated to one of our kings or queens. All of the kamehameha, kalakaua, lili'uokalani, and tells us a little bit about why they are so near and dear to our hearts. 
So in this next video that we actually debuted in our May Day show, we would like to feature our Keiki who have been learning via Zoom this entire year. And they've really accomplished so much. It's nice to look back and see how far they've come. So please enjoy our Keiki via Zoom um, performing for you, Kalei Mo'i. I hano hano o Hawaii kamalu lani ali'i pa. Hano hano. Hano hano o Hawaii i kamalu lani ali'i e a. Ku i kahi. Kalani kua liho liho O kalani kua liho liho Ka huli hiya na ka puea Kila 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 ka wike auli Ka uke kumu ka na vai ea Ihi ihi Mahalo nui to our Keiki who participated in all of our Zoom classes. Kumu is so proud of you for sticking with it. I know it hasn't been easy. We tried to keep it fun. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And I hope that we get to come back together in person in the new year. So keep your fingers crossed and keep your masks on so that we can all be together really, really soon. Now, we got a chance to work with some older Keiki, maybe even opio. The word opio means youth. And we were able to work with the teenagers of hearts, Hawaii Education of the Arts. They are a nonprofit um, based out of the windward side, and they focus on teaching keiki through all sorts of performing arts, whether it's singing, dancing, musical theater, theater and now hula. So I was so happy that I was able to teach their opio this next song. Now, it's a hula olapa, which means it is a traditional chant. I do have one thing to say about that. You know, we're going to be sharing this video here um, and for you to watch. Now, it's very important to know that I taught this to them 
face to face. And so they receive this, um, you know, from me in person. It's very important that when you're watching these um, hula videos, whether it's mine or those of other Kumu hula, the proper way to learn these hulas is with the Kumu face to face and with their permission. You really shouldn't just be watching people's videos and copying the choreography and then claiming it as your own, performing it or teaching it um, all around the world. So I just really want to encourage you, um, you know, if you are a true student of the hula, reach out to a kumu and make sure you do it the right way and um, never teach these hulas unless you have permission. I'm happy to share this hula with you um, in this show. But I hope that I won't see random people dancing this just because they watch the video. So be a good Haumana and I hope that you'll enjoy. This next hula talks about actually a journey of Queen Emma, one of my very favorite ali'i, when she went to visit Mauna Kea on the big island of Hawaii. So it talks about her climbing up to the summit with no problem at all. She wasn't even winded. And when she got there, she was so inspired. She turned to her compatriots and said, well, that was great. I'm so inspired. Let's go back down the mountain. We have work to do. And so it just really talks to her spirit and what a wonderful, wonderful ali'i she was. So please enjoy the opio from Hawaii Education of the Arts dancing for you, a mauna keo kalani. Ho'oma koko. I amona keo kalani pa amona keo kalani amona keo kalani ike mo kaya ya u amona keo kalani amona keo kalani ike mo kaya ya u kela vai kamaha o Lava i ka maha o i ka piko ke kua hili ke lava i ka maha o ke lava i ka maha o i ka piko ke kua hili puli ho i mai o kalani puli ho i mai o kalani i ke ala ka peke peke puli ho i mai o kalani. Ho i mai o kalani i ke ala ka peke peke ahe ala nihi nihi ya ahe ala nihi nihi ya ahi ki ke nino le ahe ala nihi nihi ya ahe ala nihi nihi ya ahi ki ke nino le uya ene o kalani. E nei o kalani, e ule u mai o ko u uia e nei o kalani. Uia e nei o kalani, e ule u mai o ko u hei hona loa na ia, hei hona loa na ia, ahi ki wa hine ke a hei hona loa na ia. Malani no he inoa he ali ia e kua hili. Malani no he inoa he ali ia e kua hili. He ala he ala e a a e e e a. He inoa no e malani. Nui to our appeal for learning that hula and preserving it for all the generations. We're so proud of you and glad that we were able to film that actually at the summer home of Queen Emma herself at Hanaya Kamalama. So I hope you enjoyed that one. Our next hula actually is centered around an event of sorts. We have some of our wahine that have been dancing us for over a decade and 
during those past 10, 11, almost 12 years, we've had lots of milestones. Um, there have been babies born and people getting engaged and even married. So one of our wahine got married to her sweetheart this past year during the pandemic, finally, after a lot of waiting, a lot of patience. And she asked that her hula sisters would present a hula at her wedding via Zoom. So this is what we presented for our dear, dear Cyan and Calvin. Always, always congratulations and love to you. Um, but I hope you folks will enjoy this next mele. Hano, hano, haiku. Congratulations again to Cyan and Calvin and mahalo to our wahine for sticking with us through not only this past couple years of pandemic, but through over a decade. It is really such a joy to have um, students that become a part of your family. And we're glad that we're finally able to come back together to dance hula and be together. So thank you so much. Our next hula um, shows off actually another group that I've had the pleasure of working with over this past year, and that is the Punahou Alumni Glee Club. So those are all graduates of Punahou School where I went and now teach and where our son goes now. And so the Punahou Alumni Glee Club chose this mele, Fireman's Hula, to honor the son of Queen Emma, who we talked about a little bit earlier. He unfortunately passed away at a very young age, but before he passed, he was obsessed and in love with the firemen. And so this is Fireman's Hula, sung by the Punahou Alumni Glee Club and featuring a very special soloist, one that I... You know, I, I might have had a hand in choosing slash giving birth to um, our son, Eames Kalania Kea Williams. I think this might be one of his first solo performances. So, yeah, I'm going to play it again. <laughs> <laughs> 
Please enjoy <laughs> Fireman's Hula. firemen uh i had so much fun watching eames get into character and i know that our glee club was happy to have him represent them as the sprightly young firemen in that hula so mahalo for that our last hula that we're sharing for 2021 is the one that just won't go away <laughs> i taught this hula actually um first a few years before the pandemic to my ladies and they always loved this song um and then it came back i taught it again via facebook live and asked all of you if you would submit videos of yourselves performing this melee and since then it hasn't stopped almost every week i get a video from one of you folks who love this choreography and who are performing it all around the world whether it's japan or mexico or germany or korea i have really enjoyed seeing where you choose to dance this song what you wear and we're so grateful that so many of you have um you know tagged our halal and kumu um giving us credit for the choreography and really honoring us with your hula. So this is the melee. This was our number one top hit of 2021. Just kidding. Um, the hula that you folks loved and danced so beautifully all throughout this year. Please enjoy Lei Ohenno. <laughs>
kamaka lili ko ikaua kili hune kili pohe ike kani le hua le hua e kupili aloha kulei kaupo hivi ona ona ika ihu no he a ika maka Congratulations, you made it through another year of virtual hula here with us. Halau Napua, hala kuno ike kai. We really are so grateful to each and every one of you for spending time with us every week. All of your comments, your notes, your support via PayPal and Venmo has um, helped us to do a lot of fun upgrades to our, um, our system here that we have. And my husband, Luke, behind the camera and I are so excited for what is to come in 2022. We have lots in store more of the same and and some special surprises too so i hope that you will continue to join us here and support our little halal which is ever growing um it's it's really been the bright spot in a dark time during this pandemic which hopefully we'll be out of at some point and we'll get to come out and visit all of you folks in all of the places around the world so Thank you, mahalo, and keep practicing. There's lots of hula yet to be learned. Until next time, ahui ho.